Okay. You're telling me more. Um, guys, I'm gonna go and quickly look at how to. I can't remember if it's walls on the outside or on the corners. So I'm gonna quickly go and look, and then I'll be uh, right back to craft up all this stuff. So the wall needs to be on the outside. So I'm gonna need. Um, so I want. So I'm gonna need 32 wall. So Emmy containment wall. So let's just get the applied logistics stuff back up. So wall. Where's wall? Wall is here. Containment wall. Need 32 of those. So a reasonable amount of gold, but it's worth it. I would say anyway. And we're going to need then uh, 24 heat vents. So 24 of those. So we don't have any iron bars. So I need to make some of those. Okay, heat vents, 24 of them. Okay, to make more uh, ME cable. Okay, we need to make more glass. Jeez, we're running out of everything today, Joe. Mm. Need to smelt up more glass. Right. Um, how many have I got? 10, so I need a few more. Need eight more. Come on, smelt glass, smelt. So, uh, in a minute, we'll go and see Joe. He's apparently finished the uh, the whole tunnel. Is that right? Uh, yes, I have. Well done. It's I awesome. Think I anyway. Okay. Okay. There we go. Forty-four. Or 64 more glass goes in there, and then we need eight more of these things. So let's first of all just get. Oh, we need more fluid dust now. Jeez. Oh, okay, and then we need some more cable. That goes in there. Okay, then we need the final bit of wall. Okay, finally, we got this. Okay, for Joe, first of all, I'm going to have a look at your tunnel. Okay. Oh, look at this. It looks absolutely awesome. It looks awesome. Look how huge this tunnel is. So guys, basically, this tunnel is going to be where our Hadron Super Collider is going to be. It's going to be absolutely amazing. It's uh, going to make antimatter for us, and then with that, we can just blow up Weber and Max. So, here we go. I've got the uh, crafting CPUs, the Abbey Pattern Providers, the 24 heat vents, and the containment walls, and with those, I'm going to go behind here and build our epic auto builder, not builder, auto crafter. So first of all, I'm going to just increase the size of the roof by one everywhere. Joe is actually building a new room just off to the side of the enchantment table right now. Mm. Have a little break from that big hadron collider thing. Not really. I'm just building a new room. Okay. No, fair enough. It's not really a break. What would you call it then? Just a. Just another thing I'm doing. Just another really? thing. Okay, so built this, and now behind there, that's where I'm going to build the uh, the big old auto crafter. So let's get right back behind here and. Start building this. Let's go here. And stop there. And we'll build so one, two, three, four. One, two, three, four. And then we build one, two, three back. And that will give us the four by four by four that we're gonna build. You happy with that, Joe? Yeah. I'm happy with that. So, you're going to start, if I start cooking up some of the stone, do you want to start, like, stone bricking it rather than stoning it? Okay, well, let's just... okay, right, so, here we go. First thing we need is the containment wall. That's just going to go all the way around here. The big square cube thing. Like that. There we are. And then we also need the uh, everything else, pretty much. We need the everything else.
why is oh when the uh, when the furnace is off it says that stuff can spawn that's what it is right so then we put in our pattern providers and then our crafting CPUs and just the rest of the heat vents and then hopefully this will make a multi-block yeah look at that look at that big big multi-block back there awesome and we have five chambers for putting patterns in that is awesome so now I just need to get a cable and how are we going to do that? we're going to get a uh, ME, ME cable there we are hook it up to the system oh yeah look at that awesome so Got an automatic crafting system, Joe. Cool. That's what I'm talking about. That is what you're talking about. So, that basically means uh, we're probably sucking up lots of power now. Yeah, we're sucking up a lot of power. We're using how much? We're using a lot more now, basically. But our power system's still still perfectly capable of handling that much power. Um. So that's cool. So basically, we need now a, uh, a uh, something, something rather, to do this. I don't know if it's that. I don't think it's that. What is it called? I think it's called like a pattern maker or something. I don't know what it's actually called. I'll remember it when I see it. Hang on. Pattern encoder. There we go. So we needed a pattern encoder. So we're gonna need a uh, one of those things and make a pattern encoder. There we are. So let's put the pattern encoder down down here I guess we can start encoding patterns and the first thing we want to make that we can uh, basically keep crafting is the blank pattern so we're going to need some glowstone for that so blank pattern there we are let's just make a few of those I think we've just run out of glass as well but I'm going to just transmute a whole bunch of dirt into sand just do that now so dirt to cobblestone cobblestone to grass I think grass to sand there we are once we've got all our sand we can then use the medium stone once again to smelt it up uh, I think yeah pretty sure I could use a medium stone to smelt that up with a bit of coal. This is one of my favourite recipes with a medium stone. You do this, you go like that, you spread it around, use the coal to smelt it up. Pretty simple, but makes sense. Just a lot quicker way of uh, smelting stuff using the medium stone. There we are. And we can just put the rest of it in there. There we are. Okay, so I've got tons of glass now put that all away got loads of coal just kind of sitting there as well got a lot of charcoal as well but we've got so much coal we might as well use it uh, okay so the first pattern we want to make is the uh, first pattern we want to make is the blank pattern because we want to make more blank patterns so how does this work do we just press this or do we actually have to like get the stuff for it? I can't remember how this works. How do I? I don't know if I got that right there. Let's try that again. Uh, hold down shift right click to uncraft. Uh, maybe I actually do need the stuff for a blank pattern then. Okay. Mm -hmm. So one of that, one of that, one of that, one of that that well, actually no I only need one of each I think so in that case not too difficult okay so glass goes here uh, glowstone there that there that across the bottom okay and then we just encode it like that so that's our first blank pattern there we are clear it out put it in there so now we can craft blank patterns so we can go in here and say we want a blank pattern we 
can say craft, we can say like craft. Eight of them. Uh, they get crafted. There we go. So we've got eight new blank patterns. That's pretty much how it works. You just, from now on, just can just craft things, basically. So we want to start using this to our advantage. So we're going to need, first of all, another furnace. So we're going to need a basic smelting factory. So how do we make a factory, uh, smelt, uh, energized smelter? Energized smelter. We're going to need some stuff for. We need a steel casing. That should be too hard to make. We're going to need a... Jeez. Where the hell is an energized smelter? God, there it is. Uh, control circuit. Jeez, we're going to need loads of stuff here. Which is annoying. It's fine. Okay, energize. Energize smelter. Control circuits. There we go. That goes in there to make the energize smelter. There we are. Okay, got an energize smelter. So now with that, we can make the basic smelting factory. Which we need some gold dust for. So we need some gold. And gold is here. Game is, is an old, a complete idiot. Is he? Yeah. Why? He just says he's Webber. No. Why? Did he just die or something? No, he's just Webber. He's oh, back. Just stating. He's on. He's back. He's back. Uh, apparently. Oh, come on. Basic smelting factory. How's the Paxel for me? Sorry? He's asking how's the Paxel. How's the Paxel? Oh, it's going well. He's wondering if you've shown it to the viewers. Yeah, I've, I've shown my Paxel. My really OP Paxel. He's shown it off. Yeah. What Paxel have you got? My steel Paxel with a really good enchant on it. Oh, yeah. Okay, right. Why can I craft this? Is it not possible for me to craft this? Why can't I craft a... Energize Spelter? Oh, did it just auto oh, it automatically got the gold and uncrushed it? Never mind. I'll just I'll just recrush it again. How's the farms going upstairs, Joe? Good. I'm gonna try and get a bit more cows now because you've installed that machine, that conveyor belt thingy. Yeah, the conveyor belt. I'll show that as well. I forgot about that actually. Yeah, I said I put a conveyor belt upstairs because the cows kept trying to walk out, so I just put a conveyor belt. Now they can't they can't walk out as easily now. Mm. That's a good idea, actually. Not bad. But I'm gonna get now. We can get as many cows as we want. Basically. Pretty much. Can you get a feeder in this game now? Probably not. Feeder? A feeder. I think that's what it's called. Probably not. Like a feed station, you mean? Feed station. I don't know. I call it a feeder. No, I don't think you can. Oh, that's a shame. Uh, we need an Emmy interface now, Joe. And Emmy interfaces are good because you can put like uh, the patterns into them. So I need a conversion matrix. Uh, we don't have any more fluix dust. Uh. Oh, and the cow got past it. Oh. What do you mean? The cow got past the conveyor belt. Oh, he must have been walking for a very long time. Uh, okay, I need to get some oh. more fluix by crushing nether quartz. Let's do that quickly. Come on, nether quartz. That'll be enough for now. So, Emmy interface needs some fluix. Okay, Emmy interface. There we go. Conversion matrix and Emmy interface. There we are. Put that up there. Tommy, you, how do you change the mini map where it is? So, I'm just. Because I realise when someone's like. when like You can't read text when the mini map's there. What do you mean you can't? Oh. Yeah. Um, press uh, full stop. Okay. 
that you could change it. Oh, I didn't like you. There we go. Right. Always active. Okay. There we go. So now we can tell it how to smelt up things. So for example, we can get, say, cobblestone smelt into stone. So we can just go cobblestone, make stone. We can encode that, put it in the ME interface. Like that, there we go. Cobblestone melts stone. Uh, we need to get a, uh, one of those, we need to get some more applied logistics things. Once we, uh, basically, once we basically get all the applied logistics stuff uh, automated, that would be really, really cool. Okay, we need to say how to craft this. Basic that and basic this. There we go. Okay. We say basic... Oh, I need to smelt one up as well. Okay, hang on. Okay, there we go. Why does this sometimes fail? There we go. Get that out, that out, that out. That out, that out, that out. Also a piece of gold. Also a piece of Certus Quartz dust. So first of all, say dust smelts into a silicon. That'd be quite a useful one. We'll also say that... Uh, what is it? Cows are done. The cows are done? Cows are done. Oh, nice. Okay, there we go. So that's a smelting What are you one. doing over here, Tommy? I'm smelting things, basically. Useful. Setup's awesome. Okay, then I say, uh... One basic setup goes to... Uh, goes to that. Encode. I say one advanced comes from one basic. Uh, sorry, not okay. You know, you know, what, you know what I mean. Okay, there we go. So we'll put that in the smeltery. That in the smeltery. That in the smeltery. Not smeltery. The uh, crafting. We'll put those in the crafting section. There we go. I will also tell her how to make a silicon. Quartz cutting knife thing. How do you make this again? Two Certus Quartz, iron and two sticks. Okay. There we go. Okay. Uh, then we just put two Certus Quartz, iron, Two sticks. Encode that. And also let's encode uh, two wood makes sticks. It's quite a useful one to have. Put that in there. There we go. Okay, next thing we probably want to have cr uh, made for us is the conversion matrix. That c that's one that normally gets us. So Fluix dust. Uh, now Sand. Have we got the sand glass one? We need the sand to glass. It's quite a useful one to have. Uh, let's get some stone. Another piece of stone. Medium stone. Okay, sand. And then another piece of sand. Turn one of them to glass. Oh wow, we've got tons of glass in here. Okay, sand goes to glass is another one. Put that in the smeltery. I keep saying smeltery. Don't know why. Why do I keep saying smeltery, Joe? Tell me. I don't know. Why don't you ask yourself that question? Uh. So let's just have an example, right? Let's say... Let's craft one of those and craft one of those. Time I think we should go to sleep. So hopefully. Because it's night time and let's see what's going on. Oh look, full watermelon, that's quite nice.
Oh, it worked. Look at that. It was quite quick, though. We just didn't see it happen. There we are. It worked. Ooh. Nice. These farms are going pretty well. Right, so I need to get some more speed upgrades. I'll get some more speed upgrades between episodes as well. That'd be good. I need to secure the nether portal as well. I'll do, I might not do that between episodes, since that's going to be a little bit difficult. Um, but yeah, you get the basic idea here. We're going to just keep adding stuff to this crafting terminal. Keep making it automatically craftable. In between episodes, we're going to put all these in. We'll have a good amount of uh, smeltery, uh, a good amount of furnace, automatic furnacing and automatic um, crafting for us to do. But for now, thank you all for watching. We'll see you next time in Abs. Abs of See you next time. There's a conveyor belt as well, My throat hurts now. Jesus Christ. Look, they're all here. They're trying to get through the conveyor belt, but they can't. Should we just end this episode now? Yeah. We're See supposed then. to do it like about 10 seconds ago. Yeah, I know. Let's just do it now. Okay.